Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Okay, I've got a really simple set today. I wasn't going to bother posting this because it, it is that simple, but I had so many requests and likes, I thought I'd better go ahead and do one. So if you're interested, I'll get straight on to the products that I used. So I'm using all Magpie Beauty today. The greeny blue is Breakfast at Tiffany's. The white is Plain Jane. And then I'm going to be applying glitter over the greeny blue nails and I'm using Blossom. Now this is such a versatile fine glitter. It's one of the finest ones that Magpie do and it just gives a lovely iridescence to the nail. So the nails I'm going to be applying glitter to, I've got a couple of coats on there cured and I'm just going to use the Magpie applicator brush and just dab this all over the nail. And then I'm going to sweep off some of the excess and then I'm going to take my Magpie duster and just give this like a really good rub into the nail. And then onto the white nails, I am going to be applying these Peacock water decals. If you haven't used water decals before, you literally just soak them. You choose the design that you want, soak them in water and then slide them off the backing and put them on your nail. Now, because I'm using gel polish, I have actually removed the tacky layer from the white as I think it will just make it a little bit easier to place the decals. So most water decals do come with a plastic film and you really do want to remove that before you start because you'll get into all sorts of trouble and that's from experience. So here I'm just sizing up the ones that I want and I think I did decide on the two smaller ones. So I just cut them and then put them in some water and then you will just wait around 15 to 20 seconds. And my water is lukewarm, it's not super cold or anything. And then just take them out of the water with some tweezers and try if you can to blot them on some kitchen paper. And then once they're on the nail, I do like to go in and get any more excess water off with a lint-free pad or kitchen paper. So here I am sliding off, placing it on the nail. And to get rid of any excess around the edges, just take a cleanup brush and some acetone and it will just melt the decal so you can get a really good clean finish around the edges. So once you're happy, go ahead and top coat twice is what I usually do just to make sure they don't lift or peel up in any way. So these are the finished nails, really simple as I said guys, super easy. I'll leave all the links in the description box below as to the products that I used. Thank you so much for watching as always and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!